Greetings and salutations, my friends. Welcome back to another video. So, quick one today because I need your help. Two things. Obviously, we're looking for a club, and I don't know the best way about this. So, maybe that you might be able to want to send this video to the club you support, or maybe a non league or something like to get the word out. We, I need you guys to spread the word and send this out to small clubs and stuff that maybe we can help and support and do this one club save on Football Manager, right? That's the plan. Um, so, obviously, I need your help with finding these clubs. There's headline clubs. There's like the berries of this world, which is like a horrible story. And and there's clubs that hit the headlines for going under or whatever it is, or an inter-administration. But there's also, you know, it's really hard to run a club profitably in non-league or lower leagues at the best of times. And then with all the COVID stuff and everything, there's a ton of clubs that are just constantly struggling. So it, what I'm looking for, what I would love to find is a club, and it can be anywhere in the world, but Unless it's a really special story, I'm probably going to be the sort of England, UK focused. But one of the most important things, probably the most important thing to know before we choose a club is how is that club run? We are, I don't want to support a club, and I'm sure many of you are like the same. I don't want to help support a club and maybe do a fundraiser or, you know, some of us go to games or whatever. And they're not run properly. They've got bad owners that are sucking money. Like, I wouldn't want to have done it for Newcastle while Mike Ashley's just sitting there. You know, that sort of thing. I don't think it, you know, our money would have really helped at that point. But you know what I mean? So, ideally, we want clubs that have maybe um, community run or local businessmen that was really, you know, heart and soul in this club. People that make the one a club that work. People that run clubs like Fort William, Basingstoke. They're two of the clubs... Um, that we've done saves on before. I was part of a BBC documentary for Fort William and we raised must, uh, money that's going towards a coach for Basingstoke. So, and I'd love to do that again, do our tiny little part um, for the Football League, for the game that we all love and adore. It doesn't matter if you support Man City or Farnborough. Like, it, you know, we love football. It's great. So, and I think it's nice to have these little teams. Over the years, I've picked up many sort of second, third teams. I always keep an arm for William and see how I make sure Basingstoke are getting along. Sarah Largo, <laughs> uh, Churchill Bros, you know, that sort of thing. And and I, it's always nice. And, and many of you have got a soft spot for these teams. So if you are a football team that has been sent this, hello, my name's Loki. I make football manager content um, where I manage football teams fakely in a fake video game uh it is i was gonna say it's more interesting than it sounds but that's arguable uh but i just do it for fun but on the flip side of that um we have helped raise money for clubs or just raise awareness for clubs or the story of a club you know or just raise the community spirit or just get some eyeballs on that uh, a new club or something like that so if you are interested in taking part or working with me and I'll do a save with your club, um, please, the best way to contact me is probably just to DM me on Twitter because if you email me, it'll probably just be lost in the junk mail abyss. Um, but you can DM me on Twitter and we'll get talking and stuff. And I'd like to I really work closely with the club and we can see what we can do. It might not be about money raising or anything. It might just be about visibility and, and getting out there. Don't be afraid to contact me if you're a small club, but you think, oh, no, well, you know, there's worse clubs better off. Contact me. Let's have a chat. I'd love to. I'd love to talk to you. Um, and for the fans amongst you, the, the, my regular viewers and stuff, let me know some clubs in the comments below. If there's like a bunch of links that you need to send me, like a story on a club, you might need to DM it to me on Twitter because the spam filter on YouTube's a pain in the ass. Um, but yeah, tell me about a club. Let me know, and I'll go do some research and stuff. The save will be. St I'm not. I'm in no rush to start the save. It'll be in the next few weeks. I want to make sure that we pick a good club that we think we can help. You know, I want to help a club that can use that money to help itself as opposed to help the club owner who's rich to make more money. You know, there's even in non-league and lower league, there's many of those owners, as I'm sure the fans will attest. Um, so, yeah, let me know the stories. Let me know. I'd, I'd be delighted. And please, like I said, can you send this to your club, your non-league club? Um, maybe I was thinking of maybe contacting like... The actual some of the divisions and saying hey do you know of any clubs that you know do you want to put us in contact with the clubs or a mailing list or something like that but let me know i'll let this run for a couple of weeks let me know in the comments who you think i should manage or 
DM me on Twitter if you've got, send me some links and stuff, and that'd be very much appreciated. I'm very much looking forward to it. I, it's so weird with Football Manager how much I love Football Manager. It's it's probably a problem if it wasn't my job because I'm sitting here playing the journeyman and I'm loving it and it's hours a day and stuff like that. And I'm sitting here going, I really want to play some more Football Manager. And I'm like, but I, I want to do this one club save, but I don't want to, you know, OD on Football man <laughs> Manager. And I'm like, so I'm desperate for this save to start. I love the one club save. It's, it's so different to the journeyman. It, it makes a nice change. So... Yeah, it's going to be like four times a week. I'm not sure the exact timings. I, I I get a few comments saying people asking if they can have videos over the weekend. So I might spread it. So some days there'll be two a day, but then there'll at least be one video a day every day of the week. That sort of thing. But let me know in the comments if that's what you're interested in as well. Right. There we go. Nice and quick. Done me waffling. Have a lovely weekend. Let me know. I'm really excited to go and research these clubs and see if we can do a bit of good. Like I said, it doesn't just have to be about fundraising. It could just be maybe they've got a big event coming up. Maybe they're rebuilding their stadium and they need all the bricklayers. I don't know. I'm just making shut up at this point, as, you, as, as is clear. Right. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.